Oh, no fucking way was that Hellboy. Del Toro, please come back, pretty please. Hellboy, ha! Huh? Talk about a garbage reboot that literally felt like it came from hell. This shitty reboot can go to fucking hell for all I care. <sighs> oh boy. Let's do this. Hellboy. The 2019 reboot, which nobody asked for, by the way, weren't the Del Toro movies fine on their own, directed by uh, Neil Marsh, or uh, sadly not Gelmetto Del Toro this time, and uh, is uh, the uh, 2019 reboot uh, of uh, uh, the graphic novel character Hellboy, where uh, Hellboy, he is rescued uh, uh, from uh, World War II, and he's uh, caught uh, in between both the human and supernatural world, and he uh, uh, needs uh, to uh, do battle with this uh, sorceress played by Mina Janovich, and uh, and uh, blah blah blah. Nobody cares. Honestly, Hellboy was never one of my favourite franchises to begin with. I I I never had an obsession with it. Uh, even the first Hellboy back in two thousand and four. Uh, uh, I'm unpopular opinion, but uh, I don't care for it. So uh, not not that it's uh, a piece of shit. Far from it. It's just a uh, meh. Golden Army, however, heck yeah, that's more like it. Del Toro, even if it's not a perfect movie, as I hate the ending. But uh, other than that, uh, it's uh, everything uh, that's a fucking awesome sequel should do. And of all the Hellboy movies to bomb, how come Golden Army had had to be it? So Golden Army's the one great Hellboy movie. I would rather a third movie by Gelmetto del Toro than a unnecessary reboot any day. Chances of this reboot uh, when it was announced, uh, especially uh, as Gel del Toro wasn't involved, nor was Ron Perlman, were... were uh, ever so slim of it being good, and damn, it was even worse than I thought. So, uh, Hellboy 2019 is uh, uh, at the exact same quality of the worst Disney live action remakes, just given the Hellboy treatment. So, uh, Hellboy 2019 is hellishly atrocious, it is ghastly, uh, nothing like the Del Toro movies. I mean, in fact, uh, I, it made me like the 2004 Hellboy from 15 years ago even more. I would watch uh, uh, that one over this any day. This uh, uh, ungodly reboot uh, made uh, the 2004 Hellboy look like Citizen Kane in, in comparison. And throughout this review, I, I am justified in unfair favourably comparing uh, this reboot to the superior Del Toro movies. So, um, is there anything uh, positive I can praise about this reboot? Uh, hell, hell no. The positive section is empty as fuck. So, let's get to the hellish negatives. Uh, and, uh, holy fuck, uh, there's a lot. Uh, uh, you see, um, D David Harbour as Hellboy, he is terrible. Um, he is just a, he's just, um, a, um, invincible uh, badass uh, who's, um, uh, who faces uh, not a single uh, challenge uh, in his, um, uh, fight uh, with, uh, the sorceress and, and her uh, minions. And, and, and uh, Neil Marshall, uh, it goes to show he knows nothing about the character of Hellboy because he gives him no, 
no no character or storyline to, to go on, unlike Ron Perlman's Hellboy, who had emotion to him, as well as being uh, a total badass. And yeah, Ron Perlman's Hellboy was misunderstood because of his devil and Satan-like appearance, but deep down, uh, uh, he uh, was, a, he was a, a true softy. This uh, Hellboy, he's a fucking dick and and douchebag. I, 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 I don't uh, want to uh, see him on screen ever again. And uh, the other two team members that are the replacements of the girl and uh, the uh, other dude from the Del Toro movies, uh, I, 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 they are unnoticeable. The wooden romance was extremely rushed, uh, and the dude uh, did uh, uh, nothing uh, noteworthy uh, to uh, even uh, justify his purpose in this movie, and even Ian McShane couldn't save this movie. Yeah, this it may, I may go as far as saying this, but this is Ian McShane's worst role and worst performance in a movie. Areas and Mila Jonovic as uh, the sorceress. Uh, she gets all this hate uh, as a movie star, but I am generous uh, to her as uh, it, it was her husband that directed those uh, uh, shitty Resident Evil movies, and she was just uh, starring in them, so she isn't entirely to blame for them. But she is the witch. Uh, she 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 is exactly the same character as Morgana from Kids Who Won't Be King. The villains in Golden Army posed a formidable threat, and uh, you could uh, even uh, somewhat see uh, where they were coming from, but uh, not with uh, this uh, sorceress. Um, uh, I I have no idea why she wants to uh, uh, rule the the human world uh, because because they never fucking explain her backstory, uh, and, um, the action sequences, uh, Oh my fucking god. These fucking dreadful action sequences across the board suck. So by far the worst action I have seen uh, all year. Uh, but I, I would rather watch uh, the uh, noisy and uh, 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 convoluted and action from the Transformers movies over this sloppy as shit action. It was literally shoot, shoot, dog. Oh shoot, shoot, boom, 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 boom. Yeah, it, it will, it, it will, um, um, it will, um, give anybody fucking epilepsy who watches this shit. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, but, uh, yeah, and, um, Neil Marshall, you need to take, um, 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 you need to attend an, um, an action movie a university to work on your action, buzzy. And it's so unimaginative as a reboot so that uh, it uh, didn't give a fuck about giving itself a new title. It just titled itself Hellboy, exactly the same as the 2004 uh, movie. And uh, it's the exact same origin story in the first act as that first Hellboy movie, so, uh, so it's going to be, uh, harder to, uh, to differentiate the 2004 Hellboy from the 2019 one for, for fans, and, uh, I, I freaking hate Hellboy's new design, especially his, uh, two new, uh, fucking horns that just shoot out. He looks far more like uh, the devil from Tenacious D than, than Hellboy. Um, yeah, in fact, uh, the devil from Tenacious D was a more likeable character than this shitty version of Hellboy. So yeah, I, I, I'm sorry. I, I'm I'm getting enraged. I I I need uh, to calm down. Oh, that was good. Yeah, uh, everybody will be heading uh, to to the bar, especially if uh, you are a fan of Hellboy coming out of this reboot. So, 
ladies, gentlemen, um, I am imploring you uh, to uh, skip uh, Hellboy 2019 and uh, uh, just uh, uh, watch uh, the 2004 and 2008 Del Toro Hellboy movies uh, instead. In fact, uh, I shall review both Del Toro Hellboy movies later this year uh, to uh, uh, say something positive about Hellboy to make up for this. Even if that shitty Dumbo remake is still the worst movie of 2019, uh, this Hellboy reboot uh, is uh, certainly, unquestionably, a close second. I give Hellboy 2019 zero stars out of five. Fuck this movie. My message to Hollywood, if a franchise doesn't need rebooting, don't fucking reboot it. <laughs> well, I love you guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this rant. And what do you think of Hellboy 2019? And which is your favourite Hellboy movie? Please comment and let me know. Please like this video and subscribe. Please follow me on Twitter and on Google Plus and on Instagram. And I'll see you all next time when I review Missing Link. And, uh, and of course, in the finale of April, I shall review Avengers Endgame. And remember, movies are us. Bye, guys.